A lot of people are asking, what can I do with the electroculture? How do I do this? And how do I get the harnessing of the earth? And here you go. Perfect example. You could take a little piece of wood. You could wrap some copper right around there, place that right into the dirt. And that will work like an antenna that will gather ether, which is the energy that's all around us that Nikola Tesla, Wilhelm Reich, Victor Schauberger, and all these people talked about. And that energy will then come down into the dirt. It will magnetize the dirt. So the dirt will become stronger. And this is a, this is a, uh, a, a plant that's just put on the balcony. So this is nothing even in the earth. This is just on the balcony, but you can do this with your plants on the earth as well too, and it will enhance the magnetism. Basically what happens is, is our soil starts to get dried out because the magnetism of the soil, it starts to deplete and it pretty much becomes dead. There's no more life force or ether inside that soil. So we need to reestablish that and harness that and bring that back. And this is a simple technique you can use. We put up more techniques on our website, cultivateelevate.com, um, but you can take your gardening to a whole nother level and grow more food very, very simply without doing much of anything. You don't need pesticides, pesticides, you don't need fertilizers, you don't need chemicals, you don't need sprays produced by Monsanto and DuPont and all these chemical companies that are trying to patent nature just a little bit of wood, a little bit of copper, or even use a little bit of brass because the copper zinc ratio in there is a little bit better and that can even yield even more. Wish you guys all a happy day.